What is going on ladies and gentlemen, we are back again with another 90 day fiance before the 90 days video and this one is all about Memphis and Hamza. Now when it comes to Memphis herself in particular, I just don't really know if this woman is always trying to flat out troll us or if she's 100% being genuine with some of her posts. And at this moment in time, based on the chain of events that she's been showing us on her Instagram account, people are now starting to believe that maybe, just maybe her and Hamza may not be together anymore. But before we get into that, ladies and gentlemen, let's start off by giving a big massive shout out to every single person that is a member of the freaking channel. Now, who? Let's get into the first post itself in particular. Now, as you can see this, as you can see here, ladies and gentlemen, about three weeks ago, you know, March 13th, Memphis decided to post this on her Instagram account. Never lose a man so much that you ignore the truth about him. And obviously, as you can see, the caption continues by saying, love is not only a word, but an action. Love doesn't cause pain, hurt, stress, insecurity, insecurities, anguish, trauma, or self-doubt. The root authentic love doesn't hurt. Instead, it's supposed to heal. Love is healing, not conditional. So here's the thing, ladies and gentlemen. I saw this literally, I think, a day or two, and I was like, okay, cool, cool, cool. Let me just leave you for a minute because I, the, the tell all oh, they look quite happy and Larry, but at the same time though, the tell all oh, wasn't filmed necessarily recently. It was filmed quite some time ago, if you if if, if you understand what I'm saying. <laughs> for the people who know, they know. But at the same time though, she then decided to actually post this. I believe some point today or at least a couple hours ago, because I know the time difference here in the UK is different to you guys in the states. But let's have a look at the most recent post. As you can see here, ladies and gentlemen, she decided to upload this seven hours ago by saying, hours, oh, yeah, anyway, <laughs> she begins by saying, this woman is on fire, this woman is a queen, this woman is fierce, this woman is a star, I believe, this woman knows her truth and worth, this woman has learned to take false judgments and use it as gas fuel, not everyone is supposed to go on this journey with me, grinding and building myself, hashtag self-worth, hashtag strong woman, hashtag unapologetic, 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 ah, fucks. Anyway, yeah, and hashtag survivor, if you dig what I'm saying. <laughs> but at the end of the day, ladies and gentlemen, as you can see here now, not only did we get a post three weeks ago, but we now go on seven hours ago, and both of them are pretty much the same bloody thing. Because obviously she's talking a lot about, the first one was all about love and not needing a man, and now she's all talking about sometimes in life you have to go for a journey by yourself, hashtag this, this, and that. So to be honest with you, I feel like the signs are here and the proof is in with, the, and the proof is, is with the freaking pudding. What is wrong with you right now? Get your freaking words at you fool. Come on. Anyway, let's proceed. So here's the question, ladies and gentlemen. Do you believe that maybe the relationship between Hamza and Memphis is on the rocks? Or do you think Memphis is talking about just generally understanding that sometimes in life, even when you're in a relationship, you know, you can, you know, you still need to do certain things by yourself because human growth is all about, I mean, to grow in life, we have to grow ourselves. We can't expect someone else to grow with us if you dig what I'm saying. But to be honest with you, the fact that she spoke about not needing a man, if I was, if I was her partner and I saw that post, I'd be like, what the hell are you, are you trying to make me look like a fool? So for me personally, even if Hamza is still with her, then that means she's taking him for a fool 100% because you can't be posting that when you've got a man, but that's going to make him feel like absolute crap. You know what I mean? So as far as I'm concerned, I think this is a massive sign to say that maybe, just maybe, they are no longer together or at least about to be on a journey where they're going to separate, which does therefore bring the question though. We know that according to to Memphis, they, um, she was pregnant with their child, which I can only assume she's now had because from the pictures, as you can see, she ain't pregnant no more, if you, if you understand what I'm saying. So, as far as I'm concerned, I wonder what's going to happen with that situation in terms of co-parenting and, you know, X, Y, Z. But nonetheless, though, ladies and gentlemen, you guys let me know what you're thinking in the comment section, please, and we'll talk about it. But before we do go, though, I am just going to mention this because I just have to. Now, as you can see here, ladies and gentlemen, three days ago, just prior to this, Memphis did upload this picture of herself back when she got married. And as you can see here in the caption, it says, flashback, picture dump. Please, no negative, please, no negativity, or I will delete and block you. The show is almost over and you 
and you have other people to arrest. Thank you in advance. <laughs> Honestly, this woman is something else. And of course, as you can see, Jasmine's right there in the comments and saying, I'm in love with you. Now, here's the thing, ladies and gentlemen, because of this post, when I saw this post, obviously, I thought, okay, maybe something's happening here, you know what I mean? And I thought, maybe I'm in front of, but at the same time, though, remember the beginning of this video, I said that I don't know if Memphis just likes to gaslight us or just likes to be a, an absolute troll because when she comes out with things like this, I'm just thinking, ah, why are you trying to poke the bear for? But end of the day, ladies and gentlemen, this last post, I don't, I don't believe he has any kind of connection to, to the, I don't believe he has any type of, I should, I should just restart, I should just restart this whole freaking video, man, but I ain't doing it, man. I've made this video about 10 times, I ain't gonna lie to you. So we're gonna cut action, let's go. So as far as I'm concerned, ladies and gentlemen, when it comes to this post in particular, it has nothing to do with obviously the topic at hand, but I just wanted to add it because, you know, Memphis is always in troll mode and uh, just wanted to show you, uh, you know, I'm done. I'm out. Thank you so much for your time, ladies and gentlemen. Sorry for wasting your time. Peace. <laughs>